kids, come over here. Sit down. I got a story for you. Okay. It was the night before Easter when all through the house. Now the creature was stirring. Except for Caleb and Claire, who forgot to lay out the eggs. Claire, we forgot to lay out the eggs. What? We forgot to lay out the eggs. Oh no. Come on. The stockings were hung by the... Stockings? Wait, why are we hanging up stockings? It's not Christmas. And wait, are these old socks? Sorry. Ugh. The eggs were placed by the chimney with care in hopes that the Easter money would be there. Wait, chimney? Fine, door. See, that's better. The children were running around like crazy pests. A vision of a rock uh, hit Claire in the head. Claire in her dress and Caleb in his cap. Where did this come from? Come on, let's go to bed. He just settled down for a nice spring nap. Good night. Ow. <laughs> he stopped the video. When out on the lawn, it there arose such a clatter. When Caleb fell down the stairs to see what was the matter. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Away to the window, Caleb flew like flash. That's not the window. We're good. When Claire pushed open the door Go. and threw up some of the hash. The moon made the grass seem to glow. There is no moon. And gave a luster of midday objects below. I'm serious. There is no moon. When what to do? Claire's wandering eyes may appear, but a miniature rabbit and eight tiny carrot tears. With a little runner so lively and quick, she knew it must have been the Easter bunny. Go. to the top of the house, dash away, dash away, dash to a hole. He jumped in the window and jumped on Caleb. He flew with a carrot in his hand and hit Caleb in his tooth. Claire was scared to death. Hello, is anyone there? As Caleb drew in his head and turned around, the bunny was sitting there eating something brown. Oh, have you never seen a chocolate candy bar before? He was covered in fur from head in his head to his foot, and he was covered in dirt and soot. His eyes, how they twinkled, and his dimples, how merry. His cheeks were wild like white roses and nose. His black chair and a black cherry. His little mouth was brown up like a bow. And Caleb saw he had rabies and was attacked <laughs> from below. With evil in his eyes and a thistle in his head, let Caleb know he was dead dread. He hopped out the window and started to whistle. And away they flew, somehow down like a thistle. But his siblings heard as he hopped up and flew out of sight. April Fool's to all and hopeful an Easter night.